y'all. It's your girl Sandra here. I hope you guys are having a good one. I am about to create a DIY, but before I get into that, I have some news that I have to tell you guys. I am going to be hosting a two-part collab, which I am going to be hosting with these two lovely ladies, which are Alex at Life with Sugar and Patricia at Bless GMP. We are doing a two-part Christmas collab. The first one is Easy holiday crafts which you are going to make Christmas ornaments for the 2020 Christmas season you can use all Dollar Tree items if you want to it doesn't have many it doesn't matter how many you make they just have to be inexpensive homemade DIY ornaments now this video will air November 18th at 12 p.m. Central Standard Time Alex lives in Canada so, it will be 12 o'clock my time and 1 o'clock her time. I am going to have the links to both of their channels in my description box so you can go over and watch their videos also. Now, if you want to join in this collab, leave us a comment in the comment section. Feel free to go and recreate what we are doing and we will go and watch you guys' videos. Also, the second part of this collab is going to be holiday cookies now you can also make cupcakes that part will air December the 5th at the same time which is 12 p.m. in the afternoon you can make any type of cookie that you want to but it has to have the Christmas decoration on it it has to be a Christmas themed cookie you can make gingerbread cookies it does not matter you can make cupcakes as long as they are designed with a Christmas theme. Now, for this collab, since it's not until next month, what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a playlist. And if you want to join in this collab, it's free, but I'm a, you have to have your video uploaded to the playlist the day before at 12 p.m., which is December the 4th. So that way, I can air the playlist on December the 5th at 1 p.m. That way everybody videos will have a chance to get, get looked at and you can go follow the other young ladies that decided to join in this collab. I hope you guys will join us with creating these DIY ornaments and baking holiday cupcakes and cookies. I'll see you guys in a second. Bye. Hey you guys, happy Sunday. I hope you girls are having a blessed day and everything is going well with you guys. As for me, everything is fine. As you can see, I got Helen H on back there in the background. I am in my craft room. I'm about to do part four of is this part four. Yeah, part four of my 2020 DIY Christmas series. Um, you see part you see sticking up back there. Now, the reason why I'm standing up because it's going to be hard for me to film what I'm doing sitting down in this part right here. But, uh, like I said, this is part four. And let me show you guys. Do you see this? This is why I say, this is the reason why I'm standing up. This is nothing but a Dollar Tree poster board. Now, I am going to be doing a DIY on three of these. This is the tall one, and then I have two short ones. So I have my Dollar Tree poster board. I have some um, Dollar Tree bling wrap that you see it. I, I, I cut it. I'm also going to be going to be using my uh, Gorilla Glue gun and glue sticks. And I'm not sure. If I am going to be using my Walmart sticky gel. But, anywho, like I said, the only thing that I did was I took one of the, uh, let me untangle it, Jesus. I took one of the, these, the Dollar Tree five rows, 
two, four, five rows. Um, and what I did was I just did it like this. Hold on, y'all, just a second. And push you down some. I just uh, did this with it. I just cut it off. Hold on, y'all. Somebody at the door. Hey, you guys. Happy Sunday. I hope you guys are having a blessed one and everything is going well with you guys. As you see, I'm upstairs in my craft room. I'm watching Hell and Nature over there on the TV. It's on commercial right now. I am about to do DIY number four of my 2020 um, DIY Christmas series. Now, as you can see, I have these cones right here. Now what I used to make these was the Dollar Tree poster board. I have one this size right here and I have two that's this size. Now the other materials that I am going to be using for this is my Dollar Tree blend wrap. It's the five row and what I'm doing is I'm um, going to be using uh -oh, two rows on each one of those. And the only thing I did for that was just took it, took the uh, bling wrap and just easily cut it, uh, cut it up like this. Just cut two rows off of this five rows and that's how I got my um, row that I needed. The other materials that I am going to be doing for this, I am going to be using the Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree Buffalo Chuck Wrapping Paper. Y'all, now like I told y'all before, I've never seen this in Dollar Tree. So when I went to Dollar Tree and saw these, guess how many rows you could have got? Ten. And I'm going to get some more of all the color. What I'm going to do is I'm going to buy all the color wrapping paper that I have not seen, that I have not got, because I got a big old white storage bin with nothing but wrapping paper in it. So I'm going to be using this. I'm going to be using my high glue gun. And to put, to put um, the wrap up tape paper onto my poster board, I am just going to be using my Dollar Tree double sided tape. And if that doesn't work, well, I have to use my Gorilla Glue Run and Gorilla Glue Sticks also. So, with that being said, let's get on with this project. Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times
Just come in the video. Okay, you guys, right here, as you can see, I have all my cones covered. Now I am just going to add the bling wrap to all three of them. I'm not sure which way I'm going to wrap it around, but anywho, let's get started with that. Now, I don't know if I'm going to use those uh, Dollar Tree uh, sticky gems, but if not, then I'm just going to use uh, the bling wrap for this. Okay, you guys, right here, I am just going to go down in a spiral direction. Um, I'm not going to use a lot of the bling wrap, but I'm going to spiral it down to make uh, a little simple design on it. And as you can see, yeah, it's long. That's I didn't know what, how long of a piece I needed, so I just cut it that way. But it's not going to totally cover up the uh, Buffalo Chuck paper because I do want you guys to be able to see the design on uh, the wrapping paper. The snow is falling down and the storm is on its way but as long as you're around everything will be okay. Now it wasn't hard to do this like I said this is a little simple DIY you don't have to use much material um, I had already had the bling wrap so I didn't have to buy that which this one right did come from the Dollar Tree. I bought the five row. 
So the um, poster board is two for a dollar, and then the wrapping paper was a dollar. So this is literally nothing but a two dollar project or a three dollar project if you count the um, diamond wrap. But like I said, it is easy and inexpensive. And as you can see, it does not take that much to create this little project. Leave me in the comment section and let me know if you guys are going to decide, um, if you guys decide to do this project and what color would you use. It seems like everyone is doing red this season. I have seen so many videos with um, red Christmas decor and they are beautiful. So let me know in the comment section if you guys are going to create something like this. Right here I am just measuring to make sure I have the right piece of diamond wrap so I don't have to cut an unnecessary piece. And like I said you guys, I hope you guys recreate this. Um, this little project, it is so easy. And then I have to, the granny girls want to make something like this for their own y'all. They playing on the full blown Christmas decor in their room so I just told them yeah but like, this is easy they can even do it um with the low tip glue gun because I don't like them using this one and as you can see this is how the small one turned out well one of the were well, the same size I'm just ma wrapping it around measuring to make sure I have the same number of spiral downs but anywho if it turns out different it turns out different they don't have to be exactly the same I just like um, the way this is looking right now. Y'all in the comment section, leave me a comment and let me know if y'all think I should add some new Christmas um, ornaments to this or just leave it the way it is with the bling wrap only. Okay y'all, this is how they turn out. I am loving this little inexpensive DIY using all Dollar Tree items. Now, like I said, you can display this on your tablescape. You can sit this on a cocktail table, end table, anywhere where you are planning to do your Christmas decor. And it will look just fine. You can add little, you know, the little village down at the bottom of it which I think that's what I'm going to do. But yes, this is how my cone trees turned out. I hope you guys love it. Okay, you guys, that is it for this DIY. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, I'm going to be making simple, easy DIYs for the whole month of December. I mean, the whole month of November and part of December. I'm going to make as many as I can. And, like I said, you already know the theme, Puffle Chuck. Now, also, please don't forget to look out for the Christmas collab video that is, will be aired November the 18th at 12 p.m. in the afternoon. And also, I will remind you guys about the one that will air December the 5th. So, with that being said, I'll talk to you guys later. You guys have a good nice day. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button, notification bell, please also leave a comment and share. And with that being said, I'll see you guys later. Bye.